Hello everybody, Rosie here. I just wanted to make an official announcement that the Design to Blossom Creative Workbook and Foundational Course in Human Design is now available, both in a color edition and in a black and white edition for those on a tight budget. And soon uh, will also be available in color as a Kindle or ebook. So I'm really excited about that. All of that will be on Amazon. And you can learn a little bit more about them on my website, wisdomkeepers.net, which I have been working very hard to revamp over the past, I don't know, month or so. Anyway, uh, some people have asked me about this, so I'm just going to try and do a little quick uh, review or reveal here. Uh, for those who don't know, a while back, maybe five or six years ago, I created an online course called Design to Blossom where I integrated my love of the expressive arts and my love of human design and experiential practicality and the gene keys and put it all together into an introduction to human design that was very hands-on and fun and joyful and gentle and um, non-judgmental, which felt very important and also psychologically grounded. And it's been wonderful. I've had the most wonderful participants over the years who have contributed to these books, as you will see. And um, for so long, I've been wanting to be able to make this material available in writing. And finally, thanks to Pam DeLeo, I got my act together and, uh, and did it. So thank you so much, Pam. And I just wanted to just, just I'm just going to take one of these books and just Oh man, this this way that I've got the phone is a little funky. But anyway, just to give you a little inside peek at what's in here. So if you look in here, there's a really long table of contents, which makes it super easy to just use this as a resource book. But of course, this program was was designed for you to actually go through it, uh, pedal by pedal. Um, here you go. Be yourself, love yourself, observe the flow, synthesize your parts, support your life, open to your path, and move beyond the map. Uh, this is the unfoldment of your own personal blossoming adventure. And here's just one example of a wonderful, beautiful blossoming journal that was created by one of the participants. And I encourage anyone to go through this uh, workbook with a blossoming journal. Just so you can see, you know, in the beginning, I, I support people in kind of doing a taking stock of your own life and your own state of blossoming. And then we explore your passions. Um, and then we start to explore your conditioning because that's super important before you enter any human design education to really get a good sense of what your conditioning experience has been like. So I'm just kind of, I'm just gonna go through this really, really fast, but it shows you, you know, that we go through all the types and we go through, what else do we do? Yeah, see, these are, and I give a lot of very specific experiments, suggestions for each of the types. I'm going to go really fast. Um, just so you can see how big this thing. Oh, yeah, and I give lots of fun experiential suggestions. Um, this is a way to explore your centers. That's me doing funky things. More examples of other people who've made beautiful body graphs, we go through the body graph, we go through all the centers, what happens when you're wilting or when you're blooming, what that looks like, what that feels like. Um, we go through the authorities. Um, lots of fun, lots of fun things to look at. And anyway, yeah, so here's the authority and how you can discover what your own truth compass looks like, how it operates. And with everything that I teach, I offer experiential suggestions so that you can really get this information in your bones, in your body. Um, yeah, so these, oh, I don't want to give anything away. But anyway, you go through profile and the house, and I tried to make it very fun and easy to follow, and I include... Um, Gene Keys friendly terminology and really want to see this as an invitation to explore the Gene Keys and um, integral human design if that's something that you feel drawn to and then I introduce the Wisdom Keepers at the end for any of you who don't know about my Wisdom Keepers Oracle deck um, this is another way that I'm planning on integrating different aspects of my work the Wisdom Keepers with human design and the Gene Keys here's a picture of the Gene Keys book Okay, so I know this is kind of a whirlwind, but just for fun, I thought I would show you the book, and then just so you can get a sense of what it looks like in black and white, looks like this. So the pictures aren't so gorgeous, but you know you get all the same material uh, for less money. 
And believe me, I priced these as low as I possibly could. This is not a big money-making endeavor for me. It is a labor of love, and I offer it to you and hope you enjoy it. So you can find it on Amazon. If you like it, will you please leave me a positive review? That would be deeply appreciated. Um, and that's it. Okay, bye.